What's up, friends? Axel here of AxeTruth.com, and this is where I cut through the bullshit. Uh, I'm going to talk about politics here. Now, I'm pretty sure those who are familiar with my uh, with my channel, my content, you know where I stand politically. However, let me explain to you my political position. I am a constitutionalist. I'm not. I'm an independent. I'm not a Republican. I'm a constitutionalist. I vote conservative Republican. We only have a two-party system here. Yes, we have three parties, y'all are four parties, but the other two don't never get enough people to join. And or, or it could be, it just never works out that way because of the way they do our system here, as we saw in 2020, and that's why the other two. Uh, parties, the Green Party and the Libertarian parties, can't can't really uh, get get off the ground. Um, I am a constitutionalist. I have conservative values, and I have some libertarian values. I am a former liberal, libtard, Bernie bro, um, dummy. Uh, I was dumb. I bought all the lies of the liberal left because everything about the, being a liberal is built in emotion and not fact. Um, once you start looking at the facts and finding out the truth, you leave that party because you realize they're just jerking your chain based on emotion. And, all you, and your whole argument is emotionally based. You know, so, uh, yeah, uh, that's where I, so I am a constitutionalist. I'm a constitutionalist because that covers all of us. We're, that's equality. I support our constitution. That's what makes us great. I think the two-party system needs to be abolished. I think it sucks. The Democrats, there's no way in hell I would ever vote for the sexual perverted grooming, child raping party of the Democrats. That's what they're about. They're about sexualizing children and raping kids. And since I was raped as a child, I definitely would do, do not support and would ever vote for that. I, I regret that I ever supported and was fooled into voting for that demonic party. That party is rooted in it, it's, it's rooted and controlled by a satanic energy satanic but it's ruled and controlled by satan it is and any of your friends and everybody that's any of your friends and family members they are voting for the satanic party they're voting for the party that wants to that 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 are okay with raping kids and sodomizing boys they make laws that makes it okay out there in california to sodomize the boy you know, so, you know, and and uh, that's why I, I definitely would never vote for that party. And then, of course, and they are for killing babies, you know, they're they, uh, in the womb, um, calling it a reproductive health and health care for women. Yes, I am pro-life. I used to be pro-choice. I used to be really dumb. I used to go for all that stuff. I just never really thought about it. I used to just... You know, I was on it for different. I think I was with it for different reasons of like um, because I my, I grew up my, my family voted Democrat, and then it was always like kind of you know like Joe Biden said if you're a minority if you're black you ain't black or, or whatever. I'm not black, but um, <laughs> oh, I don't know. I don't claim any of that because black is not a race, <laughs> and that 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 goes over people's head. Black is not a race. Sorry, it's not. <laughs> It's not a race, it's a color. <laughs> but um and uh, but anyway, um that black people should vote Democrat, minorities should vote Democrat because the Republicans are racist. When the only racism you're gonna ever experience in politics is being a Democrat. Because everything over there is about the color of your skin. And they're making and they're judging you by the color of your skin. People with a certain skin complexion can't excel because of their skin color. They're not as smart. They don't understand things 
like their white liberal masters tell them, you know, and they have to let them know, we got you, we're going to create a program for you because we're going to do something special for you because you're black and you really can't obtain this because of your color. So we have to create special things for you special people. <laughs> so that, yes, yeah, so no, um, I, 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 I despise the Democrat Party. I I, mean, if you say, I, I do not like anything about them because they are they are the devil. That is the devil. That's the devil's party. And if you have your family and friends that are a part of that, they're a part of the devil's party. It is what it is. The Republicans aren't shit either. Now let's get to them. <laughs> the Republicans are, they're not shit either. The majority of them are not shit either because they're establishment hacks. They're not for the people. They, you know, the Democrats always claim they're for the people. Now we're seeing, and their policies prove, prove, and you know that's why they're losing. It's a dying party. It is totally dead. The only people that are over there are the mammies looking for position, and the all the uh, Rainbow and Skittles people who feel like uh, that that party is doing something from for them. They they got they think they finna get some extra rights or something. You know, they already got. Um, they're already a protected class. <laughs> oh, the Skittles, the Skittles clan. But um, um, you know, but and they feel like that they, they have to vote for the de for the demonic party, and um, it's sad because they, you know, but uh, there are a lot of people who are gay that see the party for what it is and see that they are grooming children. They're they're about sexually um, perverting children. And for it, which makes it easier for the pedophile. And but 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 the Republicans, they're not shit either. They don't do anything. All they do is basically basically um, um, get in front of the microphone and uh, talk a good game, but don't do anything. And when they don't do nothing, blame the Democrats. And the Democrats, the De Democrats, it's, it's it's the political game, you know. They they get in there, they promise a lot of stuff, and get in there and don't do anything, and blame the other party. We can't do this because of the other party. They can have the majority; it's the other party's fault. They, yeah, you know, uh, they're holding us back. Well, you got the majority. Why you can't do anything? It's the, and that's what's going on now with the republic with the Democrats. They have the majority; they have the, the House and the Senate, but they can't do anything. Keep blaming the Republicans. And a lot of their whole base, especially the progressive, they're waking up to this game after seeing it done over and over since Obama. Since Obama was in there. Because when Obama got in there, he had a mandate his first in his first term and couldn't get health care passed through and they had to do it through cloture uh, and backroom deals and it was a and it was a sucky bill because it, nothing about the Affordable Care Act was affordable. They just named it that. They couldn't get a public option in there or anything, you know, so because they weren't trying to do anything that was beneficial for the people. They just lied about it. That's what they do. Republicans are the same. They're not trying to. They are establishment hacks and they're in there working for the people who pad their their campaign pockets, fund them and fund them and they can live these become millionaires as public servants. We need to demolish the two party system. And start fresh. <laughs> and maybe I'll run. No. <laughs> Hell no. <laughs> I have too much integrity to be a politician. But uh, that's where I stand politically. I am a constitutionalist with some libertarian um, um, libertarian ideal. I, I agree with some of their libertarian uh, values, but mostly conservative values, especially traditionalism. You know, I hate, I despise nihilism, and that's something that the Democrats are definitely pushing nihilism. That's what it, that's all they're about is nihilism. But um, put your comments below, share uh, share my video, subscribe to my channel. I'll be back with another piece of content about um, you know Tim Fool. Peace out, everyone.